eight holes. The recall battle is on once again. Angry voters gathering in Appleton tonight. They say they are determined to remove Governor Scott Walker from office. Good evening and thanks for joining us. The meeting is one of many taking place across the state and all of them designed to train volunteers who are going to be fueling this effort. And also to attract media attention and support for their cause. Democrats say they plan to begin collecting signatures within a couple of weeks. Republicans who want the governor to stay in office say collection won't be easy. Fox 11's Lindsay Veramus has both sides tonight. Okay. Volunteers in this room will tell you they're energized. He absolutely refuses to listen to us at all. We've got to get him out. Energized because they now have an outlet for their frustration. A recall effort against Governor Scott Walker will launch November 15th. You're seeing people of all different ages, uh, backgrounds, who are very excited about this. Um, and I think a lot of people are really committed to this. Um, of course, there is a pretty high, pretty high threshold to hit, though. Democrats will need more than 540. 40,000 signatures to force an election. They have just 60 days to do it. So organizers are training what they call a volunteer army in sessions like this one statewide. You're going to go to the grocery store, you may see them. Uh, at your Thanksgiving table, you may see them. You may see them um, when you go uh, maybe to your faith community, you may see some uh, signers. When you go to a, uh, an event, you may see them. You may have uh, one of your friends or neighbors come and get you. Republicans say a force just as large is behind the governor. We will do what it takes um, to support Walker and make sure that uh, um, our voters come out and vote too and make their voice known. A few weeks ago, Walker himself told Fox 11 he's ready for the challenge. Because it gives us an opportunity uncluttered to talk about the real debate in the state about what's happening, what direction. Do we go backwards like Illinois has gone with the policies that we had in the past here of higher taxes, more regulations, more barriers to jobs, and, and and less reform, or do we go forward? That Democrats have hosted more than 100 training sessions like this one across the state and say they have more than 2,000 volunteers. Recall organizers say it's too early to begin looking at potential opponents for Walker. They say their focus now is the signatures. He is making war on the 99%, and if he wants to take on the 99%, we'll stand up for him. In Appleton, Lindsay Veramis. Fox 11 News. In addition to the training sessions, the recall organizers say they are setting up offices around the state. That includes in our area, Green Bay, Appleton, Oshkosh, and Fond du Lac.